Hey guys, welcome back. So today's video was highly requested by you guys. You guys wanted to see or know what my wardrobe capsule looks like. This is actually gonna be my summer wardrobe capsule. So these are items that I see myself wearing all throughout the summer that I'm going to keep rotating. Um, they include things like basics, jackets, tops, shorts, dresses like the one I'm wearing, even shoes and accessories. So if you're interested in this video, please stay tuned. Before that, if you're not already subscribed to my channel, please hit that red subscribe button right down below and stay tuned for the video. I definitely have invested in knowing that I'm going to wear them over and over again and also I can intertwine and mix and match them with each other. So I am just going to quickly go through the items that I have on this rack right here. So I have this hat which is a straw hat that you probably have seen me wear a number of times. I have these Levi's 501 shorts. I have a denim skirt for the days that you maybe don't want to wear shorts or shorts are a little too casual, you want to feel a little more dressed up. We have a skirt right here, but it's still dressed down because it is a denim skirt. I have one of my staples, which is going to be the white jean, also with a step hem. This one is my mother. Also, I want to remind you, if any of these items are high priced, I will definitely, as always, be putting alternative links for similar items that are more affordable down in the description box below. So next item is a light pair of jeans. This one is the ASOS Ridley. It also has rips at the knees. And then for a more darker pair, I went with this AG jeans that I find myself in all the time these days. Um, this is a darker pair without any rips. They are a crop jean. I also have a little black dress. So for dresses, I chose the one that I'm wearing right now, which I can actually wear with any of these jackets. And then you can do the same thing with this little black dress as well. This one is rib and it's by Enza Costa. So by now, if you've watched enough of my videos, you'll know that camis are my thing. They are a great basic for me. I try to stay away from t-shirts because I feel like that's what ends up not allowing you to feel dressed up. So I have two camis, one lace one that's pretty easy to find. I got it at H&M. And then a woven satin type of feel cami that I got a while ago from Zara. These are not white camis, they are more of like an ivory or a cream or an off-white color because stark white does not go with everything as much as these neutral whites do. I also have a bodysuit in this nude color. These salmon tops are really in right now and so this one is probably my favorite so far. I got this one at Bloomingdale's. It has like the puff sleeve, but the best thing I love about it is it has a sweetheart neckline so it definitely gives you shape. The bottom has a lot of material for sure, but it's something you can easily tuck into like the denim skirt or some jeans. And then to top off any outfit that I create with any of these basic pieces that I just spoke about, I have this distressed denim jacket from Forever 21. Then I have this military jacket that I got from Zara in an olive green color. I also have, because there aren't any prints on here, this is one print that I can throw on whenever I feel like I need some kind of a print. I can easily wear this with the denim skirt, with the shorts, with any of the jeans. It would even look good with this black mini dress. And then this is one item, since California is still kind of figuring itself out when it comes to the weather, it starts off cold and then it'll get warm, but then at night it'll go back down to 60s. So this is something um, thin enough, but still thick enough to keep you warm. You could, I could wear this all throughout the day. I know that some places are already really hot, which is why we have some of these other types of jackets. I wear this all the time. This one by now is sold out, but I have some really good dupes for it down in the description box below. And then last but not least, the dress that I'm wearing is a wrap dress that I got from Revolve. Now wrap dresses are something you're going to see all summer long. They're really easy to put together. They give you a really nice shape. You've probably been seeing a ton of these wrap dresses all throughout spring so they're not going away and this is one of my favorites. So for shoes, I have been loving these slides that I got from Zara. These are a silver color. Um, you would think that silver is really difficult to dress with but it's actually really easy. I kind of treat this like gold or like a Nude. Next pair of shoes I'm going to talk about are these Lace Up Gladiator sandals that are by Kylie Q. I got these at Revolve. Again, I think there's only a size 8 left, so if you're a size 8, go ahead and grab them. 
These are really cute and comfortable because they're super flexible. They also don't cut me off even though I'm a little shorter because of the color since it's nude. But if you're wondering how to look cute when you're wearing shorts throughout the summer, something like this will definitely easily dress up your look. Next shoe I'm gonna talk about that I have found myself using all throughout the spring as well for days when you know, I'm walking around maybe on the weekend, I'm shopping at the mall. I still wanna look really cute, but I can't throw on high heels because they're gonna kill me. Um, are these black heels from Steve Madden? I can't find these anymore, but I definitely found a really good dupe by Sam Edelman, which is kind of almost the same or similar brand to Steve Madden. And then last but not least, for the days when you do wanna wear heels, these are really, really cute. They're called the Steve Madden Clary. Right now they're on sale for like 30 bucks and I definitely linked it below. You guys have seen me wear my other Steve Madden Carson heels to death and so I needed some new ones. So now I'm really gonna dive into each piece and really show you how you can intertwine and mix and match these pieces with each other. So I'm gonna start off with this hat. Now what I'm already wearing would look so good with this hat and here is what it would look like. I wore this out in the Bahamas. A hat is another really great way to dress any outfit up, especially shorts, because things can be so casual and can just seem so blah. A hat like this, especially for the summertime, can just do such wonders. So here I am, I put on the shorts and I put on the cami that I talked about in this cream color along with the hat and along with the slides. Now I could easily change the shoes into the lace-ups or the block heels and I could also change this into the skirt. So now this is what I would look like. I changed up the shorts into the skirt as well as the shoes into these lace-up gladiator sandals. So now if I felt a little cold or if I wanted to cover up just a little more, I could definitely throw on this beautiful printed kimono duster thing and it'll still look super, super cute, just like that. Now this I could have definitely also worn with the shorts and the slides and it would have still looked super, super cute. So this look would also look cute with this green military jacket or even denim on denim. So I'm actually gonna show you what this skirt would look like if I wore it with this off the shoulder top. So now this is what this statement top looks like with this skirt. And I also changed up the shoes and I'm wearing these Clary heels. Now I could also definitely throw on the hat like this and it would still look super cute. This is something that I envisioned myself wearing if I went on like a European vacation this summer. This top also definitely would look cute with the shorts. Definitely would look cute with any of the jeans that I have on here. All white, what a cool look. And then lighter jeans would also look really cute with it. And then of course, this would look really cute with the dark jeans. Keeping the heels on and probably just taking the hat off and you have another three outfits. So moving on to some other items in the capsule, I am taking my base, which is this nude bodysuit, as well as my white step hem crop jeans. Now I can do one of two things. Actually, I could do more than that, but I'm just gonna show you pairing it with this beautiful printed duster right here. So this would be a really good outfit for a relaxed daytime or weekend look. Um, it's really airy and soft and feminine. I love it. I could also take this long line cardigan that I absolutely love and pair it with this outfit as well. Let me just roll up the sleeves and voila, I'm ready to go. Another thing that I love about these intertwining and mixing and matching outfits is that they could easily be dressed down by the shoes or dressed up and I could easily pair this outfit with these heels. dresses. Right now I have this little black dress on that I mentioned by Enza Costa. Now for me, this is a little too blah. So really quickly to show you how I'm going to dress it up is I'm going to take that hat along with my gladiator sandals. Now already I feel like I give off a more beachy resort vacation vibe. Now if I don't want to stop there, I can easily throw on this denim jacket. Definitely just gives it a little more something. I could also just tie it around my waist if I get too hot. Definitely throwing on this lovely duster will make it so super cute. Last but not least, I could look like I'm going to a safari that's super chic. And throw on this olive military jacket and change up the heels if I want to be a little more dressed up with these new Clary heels. 
And last but definitely not least, the dress that I'm wearing, this wrap dress that I got from Revolve. It's by Faithful the brand. It is like a mustard yellowy color, but I'm also treating this as a neutral nude color. And so you could wear this dress alone. I feel like the tie gives it a lot of character by itself. You could pair it with or without the hat. And I could definitely wear it with this denim jacket. I could also pair it with this military jacket and play it up with some heels if I want to be a little more dressed up. So that is it for this video, you guys. I hope you found this to be super helpful. As a guide, I know it may seem overwhelming, but just know that I pretty much covered all my bases. I used and stuck to pretty much all neutral pieces from light blues to dark denims. I definitely have a white pair of jeans in there, light neutral basics that would go with everything, and then some cover-ups that are definitely one print, a nude and then a blue denim because blue denim pretty much goes with everything and then I have some flats some block heels and a heel and some slides as well as a hat that goes with everything as well again if you are not subscribed to my channel and you like videos like this please give me a thumbs up and hit that red subscribe button follow me on social media and I will see you next time